to Maxfield Sports Complex we go. Nighthawks playing host to the Winnipesaukee Muskrats. And early on, the visitors will take advantage of a couple miscues. Pitch skips past the catcher for a Winnipesaukee run. Later on, it's going to be Sam Cochran doing a little damage. The steal of third, throw is off the mark, and Cochran can now just come on cruising in for a 2-0 lead for the Rats. In the 3-0 lead in the fourth, when UVM, or UVM, UV responds with a man on, Dan Bolt puts a jolt in this one over the wall, and that is gone home run, two-run shot, gets Upper Valley back within a run. In the fifth inning, Muskrats add right back to their lead, Tatum Levins. Finds the hole just through the right side of the infield. Two runs score. It's 5-2. to two. Go to the bottom of the sixth. The Nighthawks threatening with the bases fully loaded. And David Marcano comes through. Smacks it to left over the fielders. Had two runs on the double. Nighthawks within a run at 5-4. And they were not yet done. Two batters later, Jeffrey Costello drops this one in the center field. Another pair of runs score on the base hit. Nighthawks explode for seven runs in the sixth inning and never look back, rolling out to an 11-6 win. And they do it without Garrick Angling, who's trying to win that fan vote for Sunday's NECBL All-Star Game. I'll let his teammates tell you why he should have your vote. He's a hard worker. I mean, he's been here an hour before BP, pretty much every, every day before a game. Uh, just hitting in the cages and whatnot. You know, he's, he's been successful. You know, he gets on base and then takes other bases. So he, I think he should be in it. He's a guy that plays the game the right way. Just the fact that, you know, he goes out and plays with so much heart. I think he deserves a spot in the All-Star game. Not only for that, but because he's also been successful. And, uh, you know, we're all hoping that he gets in. You know, we've done our share uh, getting on that website, voting for him, and uh, hopefully he gets in. You can head to the NECBL.com to vote. Poll closes a minute before midnight on Thursday.